Hi everyone, Robert Bryce here. I'm traveling today, but wanted to do about a minute on what's happening in Europe. And the news actually is good for a change. You probably heard that Germany and the rest of Europe is in an electricity crisis and it's only getting worse. Uh, this week, power prices in Europe hit over $500 per megawatt hour. That works out to about 50 cents per kilowatt hour. That's nearly four times the price of electricity in the United States. The good news is the German government announced they're going to keep three remaining nuclear plants open. They had been planning to close them. To me, this is simply an acknowledgement of that the peril that Germany is facing now when it comes to its entire economy. Electricity prices are soaring in, in part due to the lack of natural gas coming from Russia and the fact that gas prices, nat gas prices that is, are soaring. Uh, gas prices in Europe now are over $70 per million BTUs. That's about eight times more expensive than what we pay here in the US. But remember, it's not just Germany. Romania has announced they're going to embrace the atom and build more nuclear plants. France is going to build more SMRs. Before he resigned, Boris Johnson, the former prime minister of uh, Britain, said that they were planning to build one nuclear reactor per year. Um, the other one is Poland. Poland recently announced a deal with a U.S. company, Last Energy, to build 10 small modular reactors in that country. So, so what's happening in Europe is a big dose of energy realism. All across the continent, they're realizing they can't do without nuclear energy and so they are changing policy and that's positive okay that's it see ya